The ignition system analyzer features a capacitive pickup at the end of a 30 centimeter flexible probe. The display features the ignition system currently being tested, the number of cycles of the engine under test, a low battery indicator, the spark detected symbol, the secondary display area, and the primary display area. Pressing and holding the power button turns the unit on. Pressing the power button once resets the minimum and maximum settings. And again, pressing and holding the power button turns the unit off. The ignition system button is used to select the ignition system currently being tested. COP or coil on plug is used for ignition systems in which the ignition coil is mounted near or directly on top of the spark plug. SPW or spark plug wire is used for all ignition systems equipped with high tension leads. Conventional distributor, magneto, distributorless or waste spark ignition systems. The engine cycles button is used to select the number of cycles in the engine under test. For SPW, it can be set to four cycles, two cycles, or DIS for distributorless or waste spark ignition systems. For coil on plug, it can be set to two or four cycles. The main function button is used to select the primary measurement function and can be scrolled through burn time, peak kilovolts, and RPM. The ignition system analyzer is self calibrating. Pressing and holding the main function button will set the unit into calibration mode. The secondary function button is used to change the secondary display to measure minimum and maximum of the current selected item. While in minimum and maximum mode, the values can be reset by pushing the power button once. Pressing and holding the secondary function button will set the unit into capture mode. Capture mode is used for no start situations. Putting the unit into capture mode allows you to leave the unit on the vehicle and crank it. Results will be subsequently displayed. The unit is an essential tool for the diagnosis of secondary ignition faults and is available for purchase today from our website www.olct.co.